Okay. I'll see what I can do. Okay, work your magic I'm, here. I don't know how to do anything though. So. Okay, here we go. So we got simple most and schlumped, right? So simple's yeah, on the bottom this is with crazy, tier, dude. and then everyone's uh, using this poison. It's because uh, Scimitar surprised. and PKCS are banned, and Rot and Greek Curve Sword is legal, so... It's gonna ri rise to the top as... the best weapon. I don't know what he's doing here. And there was latency on both sides, as Omega's saying. I mean, the fact that Whitnake was able to R1 and double roll out of, like, the weapon art of Leto's... I can't do that. So, I mean, I don't know, you know, that's... Obviously, they're both getting benefits from latency there. Yeah, Candemir, he kind of had a good point, too. He said, like, Witnex was, like, sitting there just trying to get one singular roll catch for, like, ten minutes and, like, couldn't get it. And then dies yeah. to, like, two... Uh, dies to the L2 thing. I mean, that that's... That's bad. Slumped got slumped again. Uh, yeah. Here we go, fight number two. Losers bracket round one. We're gonna go through the losers. Basically all of the losers actually, until we get to the finals. Nice so, running attack. Simple gets punished. Very rare that we see some punishes pretty I like his uh the antlers. It's a pretty good it's like his style. He always does this. It's like now I always know who he is. Hmm. Yeah, this is round two. So simple's up one oh. So Schlumped could be in trouble here. I mean, Schlump is getting pretty mauled by the off-timed R1s. But I appreciate Schlump being here. I, He's, I don't care. He, you know, his, he was worried about his connection, but I haven't seen any skips or any teleporting or anything. So, yeah, I mean, I'm happy with him. Good, actually, when I fought him, it seemed proper. I think he's just waiting till he dies out, it looks like. Yeah, he's gonna die soon. Now slump, slump, no, <laughs> bro. And I, I, and I just want to give credit to slump, even though slump got slumped. All right, here we go. Round one. Beef's on the bottom, and Ennis is on the top. So Ennis with tear and mace and what? dark resin. Please tell me poison mace. <laughs> no, that's dark. No, I know. <laughs> that would be just... Uh, he would be a legend in my book. Poison Mace. What a Chad. He just takes it the whole way. Yeah. Comes back from the loser's bracket and is like, listen to me, folks. He really wants those famous bowls. <laughs> nah, the tourney's still going. We're in the loser's bracket. It's still going to be like another hour. Or like an hour and a half. Depending. All right. Well, we're seeing running attack, asserting dominance with mace running attacks. Two hits. It looks like, I don't know, it just looks like an outmatch of weapon classes here. I mean, you got to be really, really good in order to even make any type of hammer work. I mean, and, I, and even then, I would say Reinforced Club is probably your best option. Because at least that has, like, a combo. Oh, he's, what's he trying to throw there? He got punished for it. A bomb Shit. or... Uh, he, well, he, actually, he probably has regen, right? He can have regen with this weapon, because I have armor. Yeah. Yeah, he said he asked me about his maze, yeah. Interesting, yeah, so he can take a shiv now. Pretty interesting. He might be out of shivs, or FP. 
Wow, beautiful running attack. Oh, I don't know if that was worth it, taking 60 damage there. We'll find out. There we go. Yeah, I mean, in case. Yeah, we'll see. But we're getting ahead of ourselves. Yeah, we're still having fun here. Oh, here we go. Oh, he runs in a little bit. <clears throat> we'll see where wow, we're at with time, too. It's probably pretty late for Whitnick. You might want to adjust. Boom! There's the hyper armor we're looking Boom. for. Boom. Oh, there we go. Is that it? No, he's probably at one more hit, maybe. Interesting. What's the deal with that shield? Uh, extra stamina regen. Oh, okay. That's the crest. The crest. Whatever. The grass crest or whatever. I uh, I once made this really terrible build. It was all about stamina regen. So I used galvanize that shield, a moss, and power within. And it's like you get immediate regen. Like you can just swing out forever, essentially. Damn. It, it's a really bad, terrible build, but I just thought it was hilarious. I think... I, Poison's probably off the table right now. It probably doesn't matter anymore. Although regen, I, I guess if they play very passive, regen could be a factor. How often do you see the... What I would call the torch mace? Oh, there we go. Never. 25 and you get to go out on a date with Dante. But you're paying. Well, we get about five famous bowls for that. Here we go. Round two. No, this is round one. Losers, losers oh, yeah, yeah. Two. Sorry, I know what you're Fight saying. Yeah. Big Wolf versus Simple. Yeah. Italian versus U.S. Damn, that range. Holy shit. <clears throat> so, Simple is the Antlers guy with Rotten Blue, and Big Wolf is the... Mistake by Majestic. Majestic is making a lot of uncharacteristic mistakes. I gotta be honest. Wow, they are just getting punished hard. I mean, this might just be a wash for Majestic Pheasant. I mean, it's possible to come back because combos can happen. What? The range is just like... Wow, I don't know about that one. It was like that the whole... All right, here yeah, we go, round well, two. I mean, just, just say if you know who Simple is, the other guy is <laughs> not Simple. So round two, Simple's up 1-0. So Simple is the Antlers, Riding Good Curve Sword, and Big Woke is the Sword and Board. Goddard's. No poison buff here. Two hits, three hits, oh. four hits. Oh, he's got no stamina. Oh, uh, I guess they both didn't have stamina. That was interesting. This is more the style that I'm used to. Oh my goodness, man. That, this guy's getting incredible range with that. I guess that does, does have interesting curve sword range. Combos the bomb into a hit there. It's beautiful. Got him in the corner, but couldn't punish. Oh, there's another hit. Oh, Ooh, that would have been a trade. Nice unlock, though.
Big smoke. Whew. He's got to go for those attacks because he's going to win the trade. He's good at anyway. 84 damage, half the damage, but got him with the, the rolling attack. That's an attack like no one rolls away from, by the way. Almost always hit people with the rolling attack. Nice backswing. Oh, this is it? Yeah, backswing gets him. The spam. That's what's good about uh, straight sword from this. This can determine it all. Simple versus Majestic Peasant. We got one tears cast by Simple, the Italian Stallion. We saw the proper, <laughs> the proper spacing here by uh, Majestic Peasant. Um, I mean, the range that Simple gets with that curve sword is like, it's pretty crazy. Because if you're looking at it from the outside, it's like double the range. It's just it's phantom a, range. It's a curve sword taped to the end of another curve sword. Yeah, taped to a damn like pole. So he's so far, using no pike, hits. actually, with a, a nice curve sword. Damn, I like it. So no dark stamina. infused. I wonder. If Majestic Peasant, if he's on a lower endurance build. Because sometimes he's stopping some of the pressure, but I'm not sure exactly why. I bet he's on lower endurance, but... Ooh, very nice face. I love the spam. Nice rolling. Wow, really nice rolling. These guys are everywhere. I mean, this is looking bad for Simple. Simple's down two hits left. Oh! 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 Can he come back? It's, it's still a freaking mountain to climb for Simple. Simple is down a lot. I mean, if I was Majestic, I would just try to get trades. Even if you're going to lose the trade. I guess now it might not matter. Now, <laughs> a shiv, a trade. There we go. Majestic Peasant gets the W. Big that smoke. Pretty Here we go. Round one. Beef and Dante. Oh, Jesus. It's going all right. I can't even get the binoculars up, and the carnage has already begun. The carnage. So both these guys are in US, I think, so we should see semi-good connection, finally. A semi-good, semi-conductor. Two hits, three hits, pseudo combo. How'd that not hit him? Beef willed it. There we go. Beef Wellington. Damn. Here we go, round two. Dante's up 1 0. <laughs> I just love being aggressive, man. It's so fun. You like moving forward? Walking forward, I appreciate that. Oh, that's fair. That's fair. Core. Oh. Wow, gorgeous roll catch. Dante's in trouble, though. No. Not me. <laughs> Never. <laughs> nah, that's all right. <laughs> I, like this, this, I like the skinny leg. I choose not to argue, really, with people. So what are we, round three million here? Last one could be. Dante's gonna take it all the way unless Beef takes it all the way. Wow, three hits already.
What's he doing? All the moss here. I don't normally do that. But... Beautiful moss. That's the first yeah, moss I, I just, that Dante has ever mossed in his entire career. First Dark Souls moss ever. That's gonna be Dante. With the Corvian something. He's like one of the most damn knowledgeable people in this game. Alright, Dante and Big Woke round one. Dante got that. Thought that was gonna be a trade. Good damage on the uh, the man serpent hatchet there. Dante loves his pseudo com. Okay, here we go. All right, here we go. Round two. Dante is up 1-0. So Dante is the gold, and Big Woke is the red. Uh, Four okay. hits. Thank you. Dante loves the spam. There's. Uh, uh, four spams and two spams. More spams! <laughs> <laughs> what a contrast. Oh my god. <laughs> ass as usual. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Round three. We're a one and one. So, last one. Right, Somebody's right. going home. Somebody's going forward. But either way, nice Dante's coming back to co host the rest. Beautiful spacing and punish here. So both these guys are US. I'm assuming these guys have fought a couple of times. They're not total strangers on the battlefield. Damn, I didn't expect that. That, uh, the Man Serpent Hatchet block damage is it's pretty good. It's like over 100. It's pretty solid. there. I actually am surprised. Like that's like four hit pseudo combo. So Big Woke could be in trouble here, but it could go either way in a flash. No way! There and, we go. Okay. Alright, here we go. Dante oh, and yeah. Whitnack. Round one. So this should be interesting. Just trying to get it in. Okay. That was fair. Nice, That nice. was a fair roll catch. Yep, didn't get that roll catch, even though it made sense. Nice, nice roll catch. I'm gonna give them props here. They're getting me on it. Bro. Bro, okay, yeah, I lost. I, this. Just so he's impressing us right now. So round two, wait next up, 1-0. I didn't even hit him there. Ugh, bro, I can't. How is that a trade? Mm. 
Wow, beautiful there. <sighs> oh, wow. Well, so when next, like, two hit, he's gonna keep going. He's one hit. One more Corvian hit. No. Bro, what? <sighs> this is annoying. So they're both one Bro, hit. what is happening right now? Do it. All right, here we go. Elden Wait season three finals. Whitnack and Omega. I want to get so, out of that. That was two. Uh, and we're doing an adjustment to best two out of three. Uh, both players agreed. Oh, that's interesting. Whitnick's actually been getting out of those with double rolls, but that one actually hit him. That's one proc. So round one, less rock. So Whitnick is the poison curve sword with Morian blade on his hip, and Omega is the lap Lido. That's three. He probably needs three more. Oh. I would have to say this is probably one of the. I just. Four? I literally have no idea where this is gonna go. Yeah, because it's it's double latency and like Omega's got the damage, but the poison and the finesse is on Whitney's side. Yeah, and then but like, he's got regen, and with the yeah exactly. that fourteen minute round, he like doubled his HP, pretty much. There we go. See, now that's how you do it. Let them do their buff while you get yours, because yours is a fast build-up. So, poison no. infused. Exile here. Ooh, nice. Usually you just Did get you see something? I kind of looked down no. for a second, but I thought I saw something. I'm trying to make nah, it. Nah, it's all good. It's all Gucci. Things have been as fine as it can be. Yeah, we just Russia got him to do a PS4 RPG. reset because it's just dedicate to the time to do it now, then have a problem later. Oh, there's poison. No punishes, really. We have one punish by Whitney. Whitney is, yeah, I was about to say his his buff is gonna run out. They're trading ghost hits to try to get poison. Ooh. Look at that. Omega was at full life when he hit there. So what is that, one, one Ashen? You get 10 of those? The most Ashen you could have is 7. No, I mean uh, for the poison buff. What? You get 10 poison buffs? I Bro, he literally was right next to him and he couldn't punish him. That's like what happens with both of these players' latency. It's insane. It's, it's over... Yeah. But you see that, where he's able to... Oh, he's poisoned. Now he's got to keep the pressure on. Oh, he went too far. What a mistake. He did really good at pressuring their last fight. So we're still round one. <laughs> Just so uh, you guys I have a know. timer going on in case you guys want to know. You'd say most matches last about what, a minute? Most, uh, t a, a traditional tournament match is going to be like 90 seconds to like three minutes. Alright, so we're or at it's gonna four be like... minutes right now. And like I would say like a long tournament round is like four or five minutes and i would say like seven minutes is, seven minutes is like excessive so 14 minute tournament round is like beyond an excessively length tournament round seven at seven minutes that's like pretty much like the max 
It should be. Or it's Whitney like... made has made bad mistakes. Whitney is behind by a lot, actually. Whitney needs a poison. Badly. And a pressure. Poison and pressure. I wish Gabri was here to see this. This is his rules. That's another reason I wanted to put it at Old Wolf. It's like, so this is Old Wolf. This is where we did all the tournaments. This is like the the foundation of Dark Souls 3. Like, let's see what happens yeah, see, with actually have Gabri's rules 100% here. You know what I'm saying? And I thought he would be yeah. here to watch. The, the problem is he doesn't see it in terms of everyone. He sees it in terms of himself. So he's like, well, that wouldn't happen to me, therefore I allow it, even though that might not be the common person, you know what I mean? And I think that's a mistake on how he thinks. Yeah, Whitnake is making weird mistakes. Um, I think Whitnake... He's on a clock rate. because the, his because <clears throat> Omega regions and he doesn't, so it's putting him on a clock, kind of. Yeah, and the... The issue with that is obviously he can't even hit Omega because Omega is able to roll out of everything somehow. The curved sword roll punishes. He can't even get that. And his timings, from what I see, look pretty good. Oh, that's another poison. He's got a pressure. Yeah, it's over. Um, Whitnake needs to... Interesting. I'm not sure if he's looking for a burr here. I'm not really sure what he's doing. A burr? The bug pellets? Dante throwing out those Dark Souls 2 terms. I love it. That was like an unlocked, weird backwards roll. It's just, just it like the crazy. It's forever. like the, the battle to like prop poison while one guy has regen and the other guy doesn't. No punish. <laughs> wow, he got him. I think he only got him because he didn't roll. Literally, that was the only reason. God, these guys are everywhere. Sorry about the camera, dudes, but this is like, let me get this mic a little bit faster, closer. These guys are everywhere. So we're 1-0 Omega. So if Omega wins, it ends. And uh, Omega, Omega is the tournament winner. If Whitnack wins, then we're going to go into round three. And then he's going to have to win again to go into grand finals. Nice. So Omega needs to win once, and uh, Whitnack needs to win like three times. Pressure. Or four times, sorry. To win the tournament. Get him attacking when he's running and getting that stun. I can't believe it's been working for him. That's crazy. Oh, are you still timing this? We're 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 past half a minute, I'm sure. Uh, I I messed up timing actually. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. Whitnick is ahead by a lot, but things can change quickly. Yeah, the Lido, you just like one weapon art away from like tying things up. And it's funny, Whitney's actually playing it right by rolling out of everything. There's that R1 and roll thing. He's on him. Let's see if we can see something here. Trying to get in there. Okay. He can't it's ever really get hard punish. to get the proc on Omega, I've noticed. I wonder if he put that... Do you think he put that ring on? The poison bite? I don't know. Maybe. I'll we'll I mean, have to ask that'd him. That would be one, one of a first. And it, well, actually, except for my poison tournament. That'd be one of the first. You should bring that back. Do you know if, like, fapping the poison bite works to reduce? No, because every time you put it on, you get, like, a high amount of, like, poison. Oh, okay. So you have to put it on and leave it on, or put it on and set it to bonfire and then stand up and then go and and use it for it to be effective. 
putting it on in this situation is it's gonna bring you up to like half or a little bit more than half poison and then it could be added to wow no even our ghost hit there crazy like omega has got more procs with his exile than Whitnick has with like an actual poison weapons fast speed yeah. sword it's crazy that's true So nice it's swap. kind of it's so odd actually does the rotten grew spear have much more poison buildup yeah the it's it has the same as like the the natural like uh weird the curse sword the dagger and the spear all have innate poison buildup but no, they but can be infused more or less i can't remember i think they're probably about the same Wow, he hit him and like didn't he take got a hit him with there. The poison. Now that was short lived, obviously, but yeah, uh, it's like uh, it's tricky, tricky fight. I think we're at about eight minutes right now. I started timing it around midway through the match. God. I mean, Whitnake is winning, but Whitnake can lose quick if a Leto thing comes out. I can't believe how little damage the Exile does when it's poison, because that is one of the higher damaging weapons if you have Didn't the Didn't KH Knight do time? See, I've never done, like, time limits. Like, how did he, like, do that? Yeah, he Not saying we should. Limits. I'm just... I think it was five... Wasn't it five minutes? I, I forget what it was. I can't remember. You did do It'd be like, I wouldn't really know what to do here. Even if you did, you know? It's so tricky. And he, you know, here's the weird thing. Now, I usually have a rule in my tournaments, don't be passive because no one wants to. These people aren't being passive. That's the thing. It's just they literally can't hit each other because the latency. It's not even passivity. It's just latency. He's already gone through all 20 bundles. I thought that See, was like, going right to land. Was, I thought it was, was going to land. Perfect, it really was perfectly timed, but things get wacky with latency. Nice R2. I like the switch up. One thing he hasn't done is a weapon art, which I think could work. If he gets him in a corner and he like turns around and does a weapon art, I think he could actually hit him with it. He just never gets the poison on Omega hardly. It's like so hard and rare. Oh, this is, he's using cell swords now. There's poison cell swords. You can do running L1s probably. Oh, oh he got, he got him it. with it. I think that might be his last one though, his last throw. That's pretty funny. Cell swords. That's actually really interesting because you can get a double hit. Oh, that, that's got to be his last one. I thought that was five. Maybe that I was wasn't even counting him. Nice. Nice spacing. This is insane. If Whitnack could win this, he's... Well, he was ahead. It's hard to say what he's it is. He's still ahead. Oh, damn, Omega gained a lot of health. He didn't get hit for a long time. Yeah, exactly. It's just... There's there the it poison. is, there it is. Punish him. He there did punish is. him, but it wasn't a bad punish. Wow, that regen is... I mean, that straight up is what is making Omega win. Yeah. Single-handedly, that regen is making him win because of this... Because Whitnake has been doing more damage overall. Oops, sorry about that. Probably. I think we're at about 11 minutes right now. So keep in mind we had a 14 minute tournament round between these guys. Just one single round. Alpha Wolf, thanks for the follow. I was actually looking at chat at that time and saw that one.
Omega's gonna backstab me if he keeps doing it. It's it's crazy because Whitnick has no regen, but he still has more than half his life left. At one point, Omega was less than half his life. Nice punish. Ooh. Can't punish that, man. Crazy. I mean, th this regen is saving Omega. Omega would have been dead by now. Ooh, I don't know about that one, but I don't know about most of these damn hits. I think, uh, I think Whitnick is one hit away from death, I think. Yeah, this is... And it's not like he hasn't been attacking. That's the thing. He has been attacking. Right now, he's being a little different because he's down low health, but it's so not it like he hasn't like been attacking. It, so it looks like Poison Dagger. So Quick Step is banned on that. Interesting Quick Step tactic. is only allowed on Thralax per Gabri's rules. Yeah, if, it, if it's not reason like all Quick Step should be banned, but who am I to say? Now he's trying to dagger, and who knows, maybe it's a little too late, maybe it's what the doctor ordered. Sixty three damage. It looks like he has Tear Stone also. Wow, I am confused. Maybe he's looking I don't know what he's doing. He's he's all over the place. There, yeah, I mean they're all over the fight. He might be looking at Buffett. Two hits! No, no punish. I buff. I buff. What is he doing? Oh. Maybe he's afraid because I think it is one hit for him. All right, so I think we're at 14 minutes right now. Almost 15. I wouldn't be surprised if they're just tired of it and they don't really care one way or the other, you know? I mean, personally... I would just go in there and kill myself. I wouldn't yeah, want to do <laughs> I know, man. At 14 minutes, I wouldn't minutes, want to be here like, anymore. I know, dude. It's like... I'd just be like, well, you know, if you win, if you win, it's fine. At this point. I would even be like... I know, that, that, cheesecake, that cheesecake is calling. Dante would be thinking about that cheesecake. I already had some. <laughs> it was actually... It, it was the best cheesecake I ever had. But I haven't had many cheesecakes, so... Look at the standoff. I'm not really sure what Whitnick's plan is here. No, oh, he has Morgan Blade. I wonder if he has double tier stone. I'd say he tries to buff. I don't know if he ha he should have some left. So he's trying to play so careful because he doesn't have any region. He doesn't have any way to gain life. So Omega can be kind of more the... Now, is he able to swap to, like, an ultra weapon with hyper armor and then regen? Is that allowed? You'd have to ask Gabri, man. I, <laughs> I don't know the fine... This is such, like, a complicated rule. Like, I've never seen anything like this, really. So, I... I don't know. He should be here. I mean, I to answer a question like that, I, I don't know what to tell you. We're just doing the best we can, you know, Dante and I. I don't know if he has any more buffs left. With what we... Because he's... 
he's a set all this time he's wasting is doing nothing for him it's only against him because regen is on omega side so i don't really know what his plan is but it, it's it's working against him the longer he takes damn it i'm sorry put your weapons away yeah yeah just do bare fists oh he's poisoned nice job he only took 32 damage on there I say he parries him and just gets it over with, you know. <laughs> ha! R2. I thought it was a ref weapon art. There's three, four. Ooh, that's a lot of procs and no punish. Doesn't, didn't, barely almost got the last one there. He's got no more in blade. I can't tell if he's got tear stone. Oh, it looked like he was looking for the backstab there. That's a dangerous game. Oh, there's another poison proc. See, this is where you go hyper aggressive in the attack. Oh, he's dead. Yeah, that's it. That's it. That was about 18 minutes. Hang on, let's clip.